Todd and Julie Chrisley have been sentenced in their tax evasion and bank fraud case. The Chrisley Knows Best stars were sentenced by a federal judge on Monday. Todd received 12 years in prison and Julie received seven years in prison. NBC News confirms. Access Hollywood has reached out to Todd and Julie's team for comment. In June, the couple were found guilty in their tax evasion and bank fraud trial. After their conviction was revealed, one of the couple's lawyers, Steve Friedberg, spoke out to people at the time about their conviction, saying that the pair were, quote, devastated by the verdict and that they planned to appeal. Todd and Julie were indicted by a federal grand jury in August 2019 on 12 counts of bank fraud and wire fraud, tax evasion, and conspiracy, all of which they have previously denied. Access Hollywood spoke with Julie in 2021, and she spoke out about how their family deals with drama, including their 2019 tax fraud charges. He had some legal drama, he had some family drama, and of course, 2020 as a whole, Todd was hospitalized with COVID. So I want to know how you guys got through that. Obviously, you seem very strong. You seem like a very close family. So how did the yeah. Chrisleys get through all that? You know what? If I, I, have, I feel like I have to be as, as organic and truthful as I can be. Um, our faith, absolutely, I feel like has played a huge part of that. And I think also just to realize that everybody's going through struggles. Ours just happen to make it to the news sometimes. Um, you know, every, everybody has issues they're dealing with, when, whether you're dealing with issues with your children or your family members or whatever it, whatever it looks like, we all have something that we're dealing with. Um, but we are also believers that the things that we go through help us get where we want to be and and we we have to learn from those issues and realize that we're no better than anybody else to have to go through trials and go through ups and downs and disappointments that we're not immune to that any more than anybody else is you know so i think it's just constantly reiterating to our children to be good decent kind people 